Hi, I'm Jimmy Chang, and we're here to talk about how to use the rational root test to write each polynomial as a product of irreducible polynomials. Now, one thing you want to consider is the rational root test is used to break up a polynomial, to start breaking up a polynomial, and it's of the form p over q, and p are all the factors of the constant term in the original polynomial, and q are all the factors of the leading coefficient in the original polynomial. Now, to be able to write a polynomial as a product of irreducible polynomials, you really want to consider, among other things, the fundamental theorem of algebra. And what that theorem, just as a reinforcement, tells you is that every polynomial of degree n is going to have n solutions, or n zeros, if you will. Now, when it comes to writing a polynomial as a product of irreducible polynomials, you want to think about what is irreducible over, because polynomials can be irreducible over anything, perhaps. It depends on what it is that you're looking for. Is it irreducible over the integers, irreducible over the rationals, irreducible over the reals, so on and so forth. So when it comes to using this rational root test, this is the first step in the beginning of a series of steps, but what you have to consider is you have to answer irreducible over what. Now let me give you an example here. If you have x minus 1 times x squared plus 2x plus 5, what you have here is, this is pretty straightforward as it is, it's because it's linear, but the x squared plus 2x plus 5 is an example that's irreducible over the reals, because what that means here is if you were to break this polynomial down further, it will actually give you complex solutions, which, again, irreducible over the real says you want to write it in its final form before having to go into complex form. So this is the best polynomial that you can write before it becomes no longer a real polynomial. So you start off the rational root test, but then you have to consider it's irreducible over what kind of numbers to consider. So I'm Jimmy Chang, and there's a few steps on how to use the rational root test to write each polynomial as a product of irreducible polynomials.